Dish from Beef Tales? Yes, this is not a joke. Stay tuned to see what the dish of the day is. Greetings from the captivating realms of Azerbaijan, where vibrant, clear streams dance gracefully amidst <coughs> awe-inspiring vistas and the freshest of air. Get ready for village chaos, buzzing bees, sharp knives and animals living their lives and bringing joy to their owner. It's nothing but the charming village routine here. But don't think I've forgotten about dinner. Today, we have something new on the menu, and I'm not giving away the details too quickly. Are you ready to dive headfirst into a whimsical culinary escapade? With yours truly? Stay tuned, dear adventurers, for a feast of laughter and flavor awaits. No one can overlook the sharpness of my knives, and they require meticulous maintenance. If you're a fan of our channel and enjoy what I do, I invite you to check out our assortment in the store. Who knows, you might find something that impresses your friends and makes your neighbors beg for your cooking secrets. No matter where I am, I always wash my ingredients thoroughly. I believe this is the key to success for every chef and home cook. And hey, while you're here enjoying the video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe and leave a fantastic comment. I read every one of them. Meanwhile, I'll continue with my work, cutting the tail into cubes, all of which will go into the cauldron. After all, what else is a cauldron for? To cook and prepare delicious dishes and to clean something tasty in the most unexpected moments. And of course, we must remember that what remains in our hands after the procedures should always return to the Earth cycle, bringing benefits. This is a reminder of how important it is to care for our planet and its inhabitants. The fat from the lamb's tail is always very soft and can be used as an additional ingredient in various dishes. In moments when life is full of cooking, I look at my charges and rejoice in the calm, routine days. 
even though I bring experiments into this routine myself. Different ingredients are stored differently, but as my attentive viewers know, I prefer wooden utensils and natural products. This time the onion didn't make anyone cry, but you should still protect your eyes. Let's finish the preparations for the dish, and but I almost forgot about the spices. Who do we have here? Our usual guests, salt and pepper. Have you ever tasted lee? They say it's very healthy, although I believe all vegetables and fruits are healthy in the right amounts, and it's worth eating a little of everything. Don't forget to subscribe to our social media channel so you don't miss out on lots of new and interesting wilderness content. Now the cauldron is full of delicious ingredients, and we just have to wait until it's time to taste what we've created. In the meantime, let's continue preparing for the moment of truth. Garlic fits perfectly, as do tomatoes and mushrooms. I didn't think we'd get such variety at first. Healthy and tasty, truly rural. And of course, we can't forget about the dough, which helps keep everything together and maintains its warmth and texture. You won't believe how well this works. Chopping wood is the essence of village life. I have equipment for every occasion, 
but nothing replaces a trusty axe. What could be better than taking care of your garden and watching the plants and animals grow each month, becoming like family? They frolic and play to their heart's content. In such good weather, you definitely want to join them. Meanwhile, I'll gather flowers for tea. And let's enjoy the view of the mountains and meadows together. It's especially pleasant to pick something fresh right from the trees. Whether it's fruit or flowers for tea, one of my hobbies is creating new flavors for tea. This is a special moment of my connection with the world, choosing what to drink today and immersing myself in the moment. Here's the best break in the world, a samovar and tea. Who here are bigger fans of tea or coffee? Regardless of your beverage choice, you're all invited to our table. Join us. I even have some sweets for dessert. Let's spend this time together.
Now, let's check the dough. It seems almost ready, but we need to add more firewood to speed things up. I invite you to take a walk with me through my garden, and I'll show you what I've grown this season. Greens are always esteemed in my kitchen, so I consider them essential. And of course, we need to wash all the ingredients in clean water. After all, they were gathered from the ground and hygiene is important. You could also check out our assortment in the store. Who knows, you might find something that impresses your friends and makes your neighbors beg for your cooking secrets. Now, let's check how things are going here, and we'll move toward the main event of the day. Wow, the smell is amazing. I'm sure it tastes just as good. It's tasting time. Super. Thank you for joining me on this flavorful journey, dear foodie friends. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell to receive our videos more quickly. Until we meet again, happy cooking, and 
May your culinary adventures be brimming with laughter, creativity, and delightful surprises. Kanalımıza destek olmak istiyorsanız, online mağazamızdan xüsusi bıçak veya tahta kabılarımızı elde edebilirsiniz. Mağazanın linki videonun altındaki tesvirde var. Super!